Hello and welcome to Snipply. In our previous videos, we talked about how you can use Snipply to add your own custom call to action to the links you share. And here's the example that we looked at last time, which is a, a Wired article that we found, and we use Snipply to add our own branding and call to action to the link itself. A happy Company was the brand that we set up last time. In a different video, we went over how to customize it so you can have an orange button or whatever your brand represents. You can upload your own logo. And today, I want to go much deeper into productivity. One of the things that I hear most often is Snipply's great and it's a very powerful tool for marketing. But as you can imagine uh, from our previous video where I taught you how to snip a link, how to take a URL and you bring it over to the Snipply dashboard using this bar at the top here to paste in the URL, snip the link, and a lot of people think that that's very time consuming. And of course, as marketers, time is money and we gotta get these things done as quickly as possible. So today I wanna give you one quick trick that'll allow you to save tons of time, be able to snip links, create Snipply links anywhere across the web, and also uh, create Snipply links directly within your favorite platforms like Buffer, or Hootsuite, or Twitter. So the first thing you'll need for this uh, is uh, our, our browser extension. So if you use Chrome or Firefox, you can type Snipply for Chrome on Google, for example, and you will find the link to uh, Snipply on the Chrome store, which is going to look like this one here. Um, and the Snipply browser extension is built for Chrome, and you can just click install, uh, and you'll find this little button in the top right corner of my browser. It'll add the Snipply button to your browser. If you're a Firefox user, you can just Google Snipply for Firefox, and you'll find the same thing on the Mozilla store. And the Mozilla store uh, works very much the same way. You just need to be on Firefox, Google Snipply for Firefox, download the, the extension, and you'll see a very similar button in your browser bar. And so once you have that, you're ready to go. You're ready to use the integration. Here, let me show you how it works, how you can create Snipply links from anywhere on the web. So let's take, for example, I'm on this entrepreneur.com article. I find this great piece that actually mentions Snipply as one of the top 12 content marketing tools. And so, of course, I want to share this. I want to share this great piece of earned media with my audience. Uh, but of course, I want to add my own call to action to it and drive brand awareness for my brand, but also a call to action for my audience to engage with my brand. Instead of taking this link and copying and pasting to the dashboard, like I showed you in uh, some of our other videos, I can actually now just press this button that we just installed in the right top corner in the Chrome extension. I can press it and that would pull up the Snipply creator directly on the page itself. I don't need to visit my Snipply dashboard and as you can see it's going to automatically pull from my most recently used call to action which is the happy company call to action that we set up last time. And all I have to do is click that button and if I click snip uh, it's going to generate the Snipply link for me on the spot without ever having to visit the Snipply dashboard. So it saves me a ton of time. So let's visit this link. I'll show you what it looks like. The Snipply link that we just generated is, of course, the entrepreneur.com article. Uh, but also now, as you can see, this link contains my happy company call to action. So uh, in the Snipply creator that we saw earlier, there's a nice little copy button. You can copy that and you can paste it directly onto Twitter, Buffer, Hootsuite, wherever it may be, or use one of our many sharing options to just share this link directly. And of course, you can do all of that again without ever having to visit the Snipply dashboard. That's why it saves you a ton of time. Uh, the second part I want to talk about is the integration, and the integrations are so powerful. Most of our integrations are done through the browser extension, so if you have it installed, let me show you how the magic works here. Here is Buffer, of course, a uh, very popular platform for scheduling and posting social media updates. Let's say I find uh, that entrepreneur.com article that I wanted earlier. Here's the original URL, not the Snipply link. Um, if I paste this link, and it can be any link, into Buffer, you will see that uh, the moment I, uh, I paste in the link, this feature that we called auto snip is going to generate a snipply link on its own. And as you can, as you just saw, I did not press anything. I just pasted the link into buffer and this nice little snipply pop-up uh, appears in the corner that says, nice, your link has been snipped. And it even gives me a preview to make sure that uh, this is the right call to action that I want. Uh, and, and now I can preview it and you will see that within Buffer itself, without any clicking of any buttons, it actually inserted my call to action into the link. And that's all done using the same browser extension that I showed you earlier, so you don't need to install anything extra 
uh, if you're on buffer and you have the Snipply extension installed, it automatically does this, and we call it auto snip. It's it's very nice. It's very easy. Again, saves you a ton of time. Uh, of course, not only Buffer, the extension integrates with over 30 different platforms. And so, let me just show you here. Here's another example with Hootsuite. If I just paste the link to Entrepreneur.com, you'll see that the Snipply extension is going to start running. It's going to detect that you have uh, pasted a link into Hootsuite, and there you have it. It automatically snipped the link inserted my call to action into the link without me pressing anything. And so it's not just scheduling and social media uh, management platforms, even Twitter itself or Facebook itself, if you paste a link, there you go, automatically you paste it and it will detect that you've pasted a link. And so that's it, that's all that I wanna cover today. And of course, uh, you know, I mentioned earlier, it's not just Buffer, Hootsuite, and Twitter, and you can visit our website for the full list of integrations that we support, and that ranges everywhere from Buffer, Hootsuite, LinkedIn, Facebook, Twitter, and so forth. And so there's many, many more. Um, uh, Chrome, Firefox, whatever browser you're on, the easiest way is to just Google Snipply for Chrome or Snipply for Firefox, but you can also grab the integrations directly from the dashboard or on our website as well. Well, that's it for today. I will be back with more videos soon.